Good morning, everybody. Friends, fan, for Timothy here. It's 1042 a.m. on Thursday, November 3rd, 2022. And you, I think you might hear this now because the Worcester Railers of the ECHL are 6-0 in their fifth season to begin their fifth season of hockey in Worcester. I mean, they're off to a very, very good start and they remained undefeated. They were almost knocked off by the Growlers, but they were able to pull it out and win it in overtime. 4-3. Colin Adams got the winning goal. So... That was a big win last night at the DCU Center for the Railers because two undefeated teams were playing, but one had to go down. So that was a very huge win last night for Worcester. And the team has really been playing well. Some returning players, Steve Jandrick has eight points on the season. So is Blade Jenkins, the newcomer. Colin Adams has seven points. So is Brett Bodwin. Reese Newkirk has six points. Bobby Butler, five points. For the forwards and for the defensemen. Noah Delmas has three points. Ryan McKinnon also has three points. Philip Ballou and Miles McGurdy have three points as well. As for the goalies, Henry Tinkinen has a has won two. He has a goals against average of 1.50. Oh, save percentage of 9.54. He's doing pretty well. As well as Ken Appleby. He's won four. He has a goals against average of 2.72. And a save percentage of 9.07. So things are, start, are looking up and going right for the Worcester Railers. Starting 6-0, and oh, I mean, with Jordan LaValle Smiley, who played for their team last season... You wouldn't have expected them to start off this hot, but what you don't know can surprise you. And you know what? I'm surprised at the Worcester Railers. No, really. I am surprised at them. Starting off 6-0 and to begin the season, I mean, they have never done that in their team's history ever. I don't believe they have. But I think history could be made this season for the Railers. And... I believe their next home game is either Saturday or Sun is a Sunday game against the Norfolk Admirals. So they hope to make it 7-0 against those Norfolk Admirals. Maine Mariners had their hands full of the Maine, with those Norfolk Admirals in the last series. But Maine's are returning home for a game tomorrow against the Newfoundland Growlers. So the Worcester Railers are very hot are off to a very hot start to begin the season, 6-0, and who knows? This could carry them back to the postseason, and that would be a great thing to see the Railers in the postseason now. I wouldn't I wouldn't mind the Railers being in the postseason, because they really need to be back in the postseason. Last season, they were just a game short of making it, but Maine just snagged that last postseason spot away from them. But Worcester's hoping this year could be the year of redemption. So with that 6-0 start, it might happen for the Railers, it might not. Still not a long season to go, but for now, let's enjoy this Railers 6 0 start because who knows how long that's going to last. So, that's my thoughts on the Worcester Railers 6 0 start to begin the 2022 2023 ECHL season, their fifth season in Worcester. Can't say enough about it. So, that'll do it for this video. I got another one coming up, so I hope you stay tuned for that. Don't go away.